Hello YouTube, this is Dakima2 with the fifth video in our semi-trans tutorial series. Now the last video which I did way back in May, we learned how to connect, I think it was a cotton plantation to another cotton mill or something like that and we used the roads in the game. In fact I remember we did a dirt road uh, way back then and remember dirt roads are the cheapest in the game and we're going to be playing around with them today a little bit. So that was way back in May and in this video we're going to use this new map that I created because I don't even remember doing anything with the old map. So we're going to use this map here to terraform and build a railroad system to the sawmill in the south. So, and then after that we're going to use, uh, we're going to build another dirt road like I said earlier in the video to create a bus stop at the tree plantation and connect the workers to the city of what is it I think it yeah Brighton or Sheffield down here so we're gonna connect the workers to their town so let's get started here so the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna go into our railroad tools here and we're gonna choose I'm gonna choose the cheapest railroad I can do well let's see yeah so we're gonna do the 30 or 30 cent dollar fifty per kilometer I think or whatever this is railroad here uh, freight track rustic so here we go we're gonna connect it here we're just gonna start building it a little bit and zoom out here and okay first let's see here I'm getting some zooming issues <laughs> okay escape okay so Let's click on the tree plantation here and see where the sawmill is. So it's down there. So let's start building part of our line down here as well. So we're going to take a railroad tool. We're going to click here and we're going to start heading northward this way. All right. Click again. And we're gonna come up here and we're gonna build a bridge up here. Now I think this is a some kind of a canal. And when you have these kind of canal things, you can actually just build right across and it builds a little uh, cute little uh, canal bridge here. So so if you ever have, I think, boats coming through in a canal, which I'm gonna demonstrate to you in a uh, later video, then the bridge, this lift bridge, will actually lift up and then the boats will just pass right under. But that's a that's a definitely a different video. So let's continue here. We're gonna head northward. Remember, right over here to the tree plantation, and that's actually something cool here. You can you can hover over the icon of the factory, and it tells you which factories it connects to. So, but we'll, we'll get into that later. Uh, that all the settings in the map. Uh, the, yeah, the map here. So continue, let's click here, excavator shows up, we're going to zoom out a bit, and I'm going to head northward, and I'll come back and show you when I connected everything. Alright, I'm back here, everything is all connected up, uh, now all we have to do is put our si sidings down, um, and then we have to put in a depot, so I'm going to extend this a little bit, and I'm going to go here and click build train depot. Our depot has been established. Next, what I'm going to do is I'm going to build stations. So what you're going to do here is go up to goods platform. Click that. And then what we're going to do is uh, click right next to here and voila, look at that. Tree plantation yard. So I built a few of these. And we're going to, oh, another thing uh, might affect you is that the only time that you get production at these facilities is when you actually have a line established and you have trains running across that line. That's the only time that you're going to get uh, capacity here. So right now, as you can see, as it's open here, uh, nothing, nothing is up here. So if there was goods here, if there were goods here, they would show up here. Okay, that's why it's yellow, just like one of the bus stops. So 
Let's go ahead real quick and buy the locomotives and cars that we need. I'm gonna choose whatever's the fastest, but put under 30 kilometers an hour because that's the speed of the track. So it looks like everything goes faster, so I'm just gonna choose the cheapest. And that would be Some of these aren't really locomotives, they're just pure vehicles. Let's try that. And then we're gonna choose, remember we have to choose the particular car that corresponds to the industry that we're trying to connect here. So, tree plantation, lumber, whatever carries lumber. Wood, okay, but wood, lumber, same thing. So let's carry, let's do, this one is seven cents a kilometer, as you can see under cost. Um, so we're gonna do, I'm gonna do four of these, or five. Okay. Now let's go down here, back to our factory, the sawmill, and let's go up here to our railroad ribbon. And we're gonna put a station here. And we're going to go back to the depot. Whoops. Okay, depot. And we're gonna go to schedule, create a schedule now for the, the route. So back here, sawmill. And we click X. And we go back to the depot. And we're ready to go. As you can see, just like I said, this bar is starting to go up because it knows its service is ready to be deployed. So let's do it. Start. And here it comes slowly but surely. It might take a while for our lumber to get down to the sawmill, but it's going to happen. All right, let's see what happens here. Okay, it's got 60 tons. You hear the whistle and okay so while we wait for that train to get down to the sawmill we're gonna build a road to Sheffield and we're gonna build a small bus route so that the employees in Sheff Sheffield can get down to this the uh, tree plantation so let's see four our intro we'll worry about them later they're not that important so let's see your road ribbon we're gonna choose the you know what? We'll do the asphalted road. These these people need to get to work pretty fast, so let's try a different road here. Alright. So come across down here. Oh wait, wait, let's try terraforming now. So, terraforming. Let's get into the terraforming ribbon here which is right here, landscaping tools, terraforming. Uh, we have a lot of different options here. We can make all kinds of slopes and stuff. Converting, climate, I don't know how this works. Never, oh wow, never tried that before. But as you can see, it's very expensive. 1,000 cents, actually everything is like over a 1,000 cents. But, you know, sometimes you have to use it, so we're gonna do that. Let's lower land here. We're gonna make this so that the road can come through here. Just click, drag, and you're done. Just like that. Simple. So that's terraforming in a nutshell. Um, I think a lot of these options are self-explanatory. Um, I don't know why I said I was gonna make a separate video about it, but you know I've made it now. It's in the video, so. Let's continue here. We got a 70 mile an hour road, or 70 kilometer road. Uh, we're gonna connect that here to the city street. And by the way, city streets, you can bring those in. I think this is street cobblestone. But then you also have the special tools, special construction tools, or uh, not those. I think there's a setting where you can yeah, if you change player here, change player, 
you get these uh, map editing tools and then they give you special uh, city street tools I guess so you're basically acting as the uh, public public service account <laughs> would you look at that look at how far in debt we are 32 million dollars we're not gonna do that so let's switch back to a uh, human player and exit out of here and where were we oh yeah we were trying to build a uh, bus system here so we can bring the players to the tree plantation so first off we're going to go here to garage uh, build a garage where can we put how about right here right in the middle of the city okay um now we're gonna build a bus stop a bunch of bus stops actually so bus stop and post box yeah that's what we no no we want something small so we're gonna put one let's see here come on you can do it there we go okay so wherever the people are i think i'm gonna put them one there one by the city or uh over there so we're hitting the points of interest that that's what matters oh geez <laughs> oh that was a mistake i was trying to drag the map and then i clicked everywhere that wasn't supposed to happen Oh, well, we'll just connect them all at this point. We'll, you know, I mean, nothing we can do about it. Okay, so let's go to our garage here. And uh, so, by the way, that uh, this tree plantation doesn't take mail, as you can see. If it did, it would show up here. So we don't have to worry about mail. If we did, we get like a, a mail trailer or something. A mail trailer uh, somewhere like, I don't know they have they have all kinds of stuff I, I can't memorize it, all of it but uh we're just gonna choose a basic bus here um one that's decently fast because remember we put in a 70 kilometer an hour road here so Let's just go with this one. Yeah, enough time spent looking at buses. Okay, so let's create a, a, a schedule here. One, two, oh wait. So if you click on a place that is not a bus stop, it's just gonna stop us. Sort or just gonna pop up as waypoint. So we don't want that. So click remove. Okay, so let's zoom in here closer so we can see. There we go. The church. Um, this. And then I should we'll do one there. At these uh, obscure stations I created for no reason. Um, and yeah, we have to put a bus stop, bus stop here. Uh-oh. So, okay, never mind. I'm just going to delete that. I'll save that for another video. Uh, let's see here. I wonder why. Hmm. We'll, we'll worry about that later. So... So as long as you're next to like whatever station you have set up here, then it'll uh, it'll expand its reach to different station tiles. So you have a station or a stop, it doesn't really matter. So we're gonna add a stop here, and there we go. That's how we're gonna get the uh, the workers to the plantation. Okay. Uh, let's press start here. And let's see where the bus is. Okay, so what we're gonna do here is we're gonna lock onto this and fast forward the game a bit. Okay, 
So... Obviously, uh... It's gonna take some time for these passengers to get on the bus and head over to, uh... The plantation, but they will do it, eventually. That's how it works. Okay, so... We're gonna, uh, detach from this. And we're gonna go check on that train that we had going to the sawmill. See how it's doing. Uh-oh. It's going... Fast for a 30 kilometer an hour train. So, oh wait, yeah, we gotta slow down. Okay, so... Dump that off. Uh, and look at that! We're positive income. That's pretty good. So, uh... I don't think we're making money right now. Are we? Yeah, we're losing money, but you know, it's it's. You need to know what you're doing, and uh, we're on the right track. So thank you everybody for tuning into the video. I hope you, I hope I taught you something about railroads, terraforming, and even more about the buses. Um, I'd like to know what would you like me to do in the future? Different kind of videos. I don't always play semi trains. I have a Mac computer. It's not the most powerful thing in the world, but you know, I'm always uh, open to new ideas. I actually bought a uh, pretty uh, nice microphone here on Amazon for 15 bucks. Condenser microphone and sounds great. I hope you like my voice. I hope you like the uh, the quality of the voice. Um, yeah, so please tell me. What are you interested in? Any game that you have for me, I will play. I'll do tutorials. I'll do whatever. Thanks everybody for watching. Have a nice day.